What's going on, my dudes? Midnight Sun 518 here, and we are back with another episode of Subnautica See, Below Zero. Working here with your spy penguins. Do all humans like work? The lucky ones do. Are you lucky? I used to think I was. Well, before I was so rudely interrupted, um, we are back. I like how I can just scan a freaking name tag. Uh, we are back with another episode of Subnautica, and where we left off, we were coming up on this dope freaking thing. Oh man, your fish tank is still going, that's good. Cold suit? Yo! That's what I'm talking about. But yeah, we came up on this base, uh, and we're apparently, uh, maybe, sorta, of, kinda. Ooh, we got a new jukebox, too! Fuck yeah! I love finding new things. Um... But yeah, we got this new base to explore. Water source. Water purification tablets can create drinkable water as you explore the snowy surface. Oh my god, there's so much stuff here. This is amazing. This must have been Sam's room. Oh, that's sad. But something's not right. Oh my god, we are we are getting a lot of uh a lot of stuff. Why is the why is it so fucked in here? Alright, let's go ahead and look at some of this. Uh, voice logs, yeah. We're missing all these. Alright, well, uh... I guess we're gonna kinda continue on here. That was a whole lot of random information that I have slowly accumulated. I guess we can't go that way. I guess we'll go back out the way that we came. Man, this place is fucked up. What else is there to discover? Definitely that. We'll go that way in a second. Uh, I really want to know if I can get into the other side of this base. Ooh, I can. That's awesome. Hell yeah. Scanning, scanning. Don't really care about that, but I can probably turn it into something. I already have this. That's just going to be free titanium. I'm going left. Picture frame. Sick, dude. Please tell me that was a hang in there, baby. Oh, <laughs> you brought a friend. Spy Pangolin in training. We're recording audio. Is that okay? Of course. I have the photos yes. you sent. <laughs> um, what am I looking at here? Raw pustules on the frozen leviathan. That's nothing to worry about in and of itself. It's well contained. The ice samples suggest it's been frozen since the time of the outbreak. The strain made the planet uninhabitable. If it mutates... Are you feeling unsafe? Very. Uh, if I escalate this issue for you, will you feel comfortable enough to concentrate again? I have deadlines for the snow fox and the mining bots coming up. I really need your focus on the penguins. Oh, yeah. That's a relief, actually. I was expecting more of a fight. Nothing is more important than our safety. I'll take care of it, okay? Thanks. I won't let you down. <laughs> Thanks, Sam. Keep up the good work. Okay, and then what was the... Yeah, we already did the ore vein logs and communications. That one. Hey, guys. I'm so glad you're here. Where else would I be? Like I'd miss Fred being exposed as the alien intruder. <laughs> That's not gonna happen. But you didn't say you were not the intruder. No, not this argument again. I beg you. I think the game will settle this debate. <sighs> so, I just want to ask you something quick before Zeta gets back and we start playing. It's about the cavern with the frozen Leviathan. I investigated and- You I investigated? When? I didn't see you. Maybe you were asleep or busy doodling inappropriate sea creatures. Those drawings are art. Anyway, 
I've looked into it, and I think we have reason to be concerned. It wasn't that long ago this planet was uninhabitable. But if we work together, we can get them to put an end to the Kara mutation experiments. I, I, I'm, I'm not comfortable with this. Samantha, you're paranoid. Come on now. You're Sam out. She has her safety at heart. And the rest of us don't? Zeta! <sighs> can we play the game now? Fine. Well, this sucks that my inventory is now full. There is so much more to check out. Well, I guess we already went down that way. Alright, well, um, that is... Kind of seems like that's the about the gist of what I can do in this area. It does seem like the research team was pretty well, like, incorporated with each other. Um, like, friendship-wise. Alright, let's go ahead and head up this way. Head up the hill. Let's see if we can't find something cool over here. I'd love to go over and drop off Dangerous all this stuff. Seek shelter. Well, it's too late for that. Just going to run back and forth between... Oh, shit. <laughs> Okay. Uh, let me up. Let me up. Let me. Guess I can't go that way. I would very much like to stand on top of a thermal vent right about now. Guess I'm not going to. I'll go towards the light instead. Maybe there's something over here that's cool. Pick up snow. Uh. Unless this is like one of the other ways of getting into where the base is. Hello? What's this way? Oh, thank God. Are you kidding me? How the fuck do I kill that? Can, can I kill it? Oh, shit. Ow! 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 Fuck you! Ah! I killed it! Bitch! Did I get anything for it? How the fuck do I get the fur? Oh, do I have to... Do I have to just, like, sneak up on it or something? Well, um... That may have been animal cruelty. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, that's how I get the fur. Not my fault. Alright, what do I not care about? I don't care about the copper. And drink that. Uh, okay, I really need to get back to the house. Man, if I had known there'd be magnetite in this cave the whole time. Whee! This may have been a terrible idea. Well, let's go ahead and head back. We can drop off a whole bunch of stuff in the ship. Oh, come on. How do I get out of here? I just want to go home. Snow fox fragment. We have ourselves a snow fox. Oh, no. I need a third one. Never mind. False alarm. 
Sorry. Ooh, what's over here? Hello? Anybody home? Anything to scan? Like that. Ooh, frost based plant. We can make synthetic water. And by synthetic water, I mean we can just make water. Um, using these little bulb things. But I'm not going to do that, because I have plenty of other ways to, to make water, so there's really no point. But if there's other cool stuff in this cave, that would be very convenient. What's in here? A flare! I don't... I don't care. What's in here? Food brick. Okay, that's actually kind of important. You know what? Fuck it. Anything else cool around here? This has to lead somewhere cool, right? Or it just leads back outside. Awesome. Whee! Um... Well... Suppose we'll go this way. Because I don't know where the flip and flap I'm going. Oh, thank God, sunrise. Ow. Frosted sinew tree? That sounds disgusting. Oh, we're back here. Okay. Now I'm picking up what you're putting down. And we still haven't made it to the ancient artifact. I don't like these really loud noises that are coming from all around me. Can I pick these up? Um, well, we did just get a whole bunch of magnetite, and I don't remember the other things that I needed it for. I know I needed it for the little, like, desktop um, Newton ball thing that I made, which I have already completed, by the way. Um, I don't think I had that in the last video. But it is indeed on my desk, just Newton balling itself away. Uh, but other than that, um, I don't remember what all we needed the magnetite for. You son of a bitch. There is something of significance beyond this bridge. It was important to Otera, but more important to me. Will it help us build you a body? I believe so, yes. Requires hydraulic fluid? What do you mean it requires hydraulic fluid? Where the flip do I get hydraulic fluid from? Where's my thing? Oh, you're down there? Oh. Okay. Whee! Where's my... Oh, you're all the way over here. I didn't realize I didn't have to go all the way into this. So I guess this ancient artifact, we have to make hydraulic fluid to extend the bridge, maybe, to get over there. We might not be able to access it by, uh, by water. Well, yeah, I, I understand that inventory is full. Thank you for letting me know uh, cordially. I really do appreciate it. Um, there's nothing that I was more unsure of than the fact that my inventory is full. Okay, well, I suppose there's a recipe for making hydraulic fluid, and I'm curious if we have the ability to make it while we're out here so we don't have to turn around and go all the way back to the house, because that would suck. Go ahead and connect. Thank you. All right, let's see what we got. Hydraulic fluid. Ah, we can! Of course, it takes gel sacks and creep vine seed clusters. Two things that I cannot get while I'm out here. That sucks. Oh, man, I only need one stalker fur. Oh. Make that. And I can't make that because I don't have another stalker fur. Uh, let's go ahead and drop off a whole bunch of this crap. In our storage lockers that are all full. Because that's how we roll. We roll like this. Oh, that's so sick. Now I got gloves on. What's the other thing? Oh, the other one's a hat, so it probably replaces my rebreather. I wonder... Yeah, 10% cold resistance. Dude, that's so sick. Uh, uh, what is this? Oh, yeah, the water purification tablet. Neat. I assume that both of these just prolong the cold, but don't actually make it any better. Well, I guess we're heading back to the freaking house, because um, we're... 
We need all that stuff. It's so far away, though. Man, that sucks. Ooh. Man, there's a lot to explore down here, though. All right, well, either way, let's go ahead and change this beacon to yellow, because we've seen it, kind of, but this is the base, and we really... Actually, you know what? We're going to leave that orange, and then I'm going to go ahead and drop a beacon, because I have one right here. I'm going to go ahead and drop it right over here next to the actual entrance. This way we will never forget. Whee. Sam's base. Poor Sam. Hopefully we find Sam one day. Cool. And then that one we can make green, not green, yellow. Um, because it's an important spot. Sick nasty, dude. All right, well, we're going to go ahead and head back to the house after I see if I can scan this, because this actually looks very scannable. Uh, and it appears that it is not. What a waste of time. Yeah, so I'm going to head back to the house uh, and offload a whole bunch of this crap and see if we can't at least make a few more of these recipes that I have on the screen, as well as make our hydraulic fluid, because um, I have a fuck whack of lead now, which is awesome. I went on a lead hunting spree um, sort of kind of in between episodes, if not last episode, but... Man, you're so cool looking! I want to scan you. Hold up. Please don't be evil. Because the evil ones are always the ones that look really fucking cool. Arctic Ray! Oh, you don't look evil at all, because you're not attacking me. You're so cool! Alright. Uh, onwards to the house, and I'll see ya when we get there. Or maybe when we get back, because I'm going to make a whole bunch of these recipes and then probably head straight back over here. So I'll see you in a second either way. Well, my dudes, um, so we're back again. Uh, I'm at the house, obviously. I've done a whole bunch of recipe doing. Uh, if you look at the top right, those are the only two that I haven't finished yet. The snow fox um, like platform thing. I don't know where to craft that at. I've checked here. I've checked here. And I don't know where the heck I'm supposed to craft that at. So I figured I'd just kind of like keep those materials on me. And then whenever that comes around, it'll happen. And then same with the uh, the module in the top right. That freaking... Um, see if I can't find it. Parallel processing unit. I have no freaking clue where the heck that comes from. Um, so I got to figure that out. But if you look at my inventory, I have a lot of goodies, which is freaking awesome. So I have a Mark III um, depth upgrade for the sea truck, uh, Mark II for the prawn suit. I got my grappling arm. I got the thermal reactor, which will recharge the prawn suit's batteries while I'm sitting on top of a thermal vent um, or something like that, uh, which is dope. And then I also got the hydraulic fluid. So I guess the, I, the next step... Um, we could head back to the... wherever it is. Nope, none of those. Uh, that one. We could be head back to that one and use the hydraulic fluid to extend that bridge and then maybe check out that artifact, uh, which would be nice. The other thing we need to do eventually is head back down here, um, but that's after shutting down the main island thingamajig by using this, the test override module, which I don't have because I don't know where to get the parallel processing, processing unit. Um... Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and throw some of these depth modules on my stuff, and then we'll probably head back over here to knock out the artifact, since that's actually something that we can do. Um, oh yeah, and then these are my new posters. So I have this little light bulb in a robot hand, and then my... Uh... Oh crap, where is it? It's over here. My hang in there! My little cat! I freaking love this poster, man. I don't know where this started, um, the like hang in there baby poster. I don't know where that came from originally but i'm really excited that they threw that into this game all right so we're gonna go ahead and hop in here because in order to use our modules and stuff we have to be inside of our thing um oh yeah something else that i did I'll show you real quick while we are outside to throw the modules on um i added another storage module so we have one here and one here uh, which will be nice, because that means that I have doubled the amount of storage that I can use. All right, sea truck depth module, and the rest of this... Ooh, a thousand meters! No shit, that's freaking awesome. Uh, let's go over here. Access upgrades. That one, that one, and that one. 
now we are maxed out 1100 meters that's really not that much better than the sea truck uh cool yeah then we have the grappling arm which is super dope which means that we can grab onto the walls and stuff and then don't have to worry about that all right i'm gonna swim really far away for a second so i can get rid of a lot of these fish that i have picked up because i don't i totally just ate all of them <laughs> All right, um, you saw nothing. <laughs> I didn't realize that that, that, that was going to happen. Nope. Can you reattach? Of course, you're not going to reattach legitimately every time. Uh, when I want you to reattach, you won't. But when I don't want you to reattach, you do. Why is it that that is how things work? Cool. So we have now two storage modules, which means we have one, two, three, four, five, ten lockers uh, at our disposal, which is great. But it also sucks because the sea truck, it doesn't act like a snake, you know? I kind of wish that it did because um, that would make turning it around super easy. Instead, it's like this gigantic, long, super thick brick thing. Um, that moves as one unit, which makes it really hard to turn around. But whatever. Um, I guess... I don't know where to find this uh, in the upper right, that, like, little beacon thingamajig. Whatever that cylinder is that I'm supposed to make, that I don't remember what it's called. Um, I don't know where to find that. Unfortunately, maybe that's something that's just in or around the base that I was at. Because I know the, the woman that I was talking to with the really crazy-looking prawn suit... Um, was saying that she had some components there that I could use to turn off the beacon thingamajig. Um, so maybe that is down there and I just missed it. I feel like I was pretty thorough with the kind of hunting around inside of her base and scanning and clicking that I was doing. Uh, but maybe I wasn't thorough enough. And then I also did a lap around the outside. So I don't know. I don't know where that's supposed to be. But obviously I can't craft it because it's not in any of the spots that I'd be able to craft it at. Um, and holy shit, this is slow. Wow. I guess the more modules you put on the sea truck, the slower it goes. And I'd really like to get a speed upgrade, but I can't do that because I don't know where the heck to get the, um, last, like, scannable portion to give me the sea truck speed upgrade. So, I'm stuck with this. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and head back over here and see if we can't, uh, check out this ancient artifact. And that's probably gonna close out the episode, so... Um, yeah, as you guys know, I usually, if you're new here, I usually try to keep the episodes right around 30 minutes, uh, cause anything more than that, I don't know. Whenever I click on a video and it's longer than 30 minutes, I am more inclined to not watch all of it just cause it's way too long and the ADHD and stuff. Uh, but yeah, so we're going to get over here. We'll check out this artifact if it lets me, and at least we'll see the other side of the bridge. I don't know if the artifact is over there, but we'll at least see the other side of the bridge. Uh, and then we'll probably end the episode. So, I'm gonna I'm gonna cut off the the video until we get there because I'm traveling very slow and I don't have the words that are gonna span the next 300 meters. So, see you in a second. Well, we made it. We're back. I did not mean to pick up the snow. Uh, I don't care about titanium and I don't care about snowballs. I mean, I do kind of care about. Do they just get reabsorbed? That's kind of cool. Uh, I do kind of care about the snowballs because I want to make a snowman. I think that'd be fun. All right, we'll deposit that. Ah, we've repaired the bridge. Uh, extend. Attention, check fluid. Oh. Yes! Oh, yeah, that's what I want to see. Oh, that's so glorious. Why is it at such an angle, though? Ah, oh, we can retract it on this end. I wonder if you just, like, extend it and, track and retract it too much if it breaks the bridge. A flare? I don't care about flares. Um, all right. To the northeast, huh? Of what? I'll go that way. Okay, that's not ominous at all. Uh, we'll go check that out in a minute. Because I want to see anything and everything that I can check out over here. And there's a tiny little cave. You did say northeast, so I'll have to keep that in mind. Um, while I'm going not northeast. In fact, I'm going the opposite of that. What's over here? Anything? A hole? A way down to the ocean? That's cool. 
I'm gonna go ahead and run up this way, I suppose. Maybe we'll find another frost bear thing. And steal more of its fur. Hmm. Well, here's something. Anything good? Don't care to read any of that. Should I read it? Probably. A thumper? I know that's what that thing was talking about, so it's probably pretty important that I read it. New blueprint synthesized. Still not going to. Uh, ooh. Tunnels. Titanium. What are you? Silver? Copper? Sure, I'll grab all of this. Just because I'm here. That was frustrating. Onwards and upwards, I guess. Um, was that everything that's over here that's relatively important? Ooh, there's something shoved into the rock here. Oh, it's just more ore. More silver and copper. Hmm. It's a very large, like, open space. I don't see anything fancy. I'm surprised that sprinting doesn't keep me warm. Because I promise you, that's how it works in uh, in real life. If you just kind of like sprint, you definitely stay warmer. Where the flipping... F oh, there's green. I bet you that's where I'm supposed to go. Nope. Okay. Oh, crap. I didn't grab my thermoses. I have two of them now. And I didn't bother to grab each of them. Or any of them. Uh, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that's probably what the thumper's for. Oh, yay. We're back here. I say back here, but this might actually be a new place. So, let's go ahead and drop our spy pangolin. Agent? Yeah, we've definitely not been here. Give me your cue, boy. Alright, I don't care about this quartz that's in here. I really don't care about the ion cubes anyways. Yeah, I really don't care about the ion cubes, but, I mean, they're here, so. Just gonna grab them because I can. Q to self-destruct. That's cool. Alright, well. I'm gonna continue onwards here. Maybe there's something else that's cool. Where is the artifact thing? 430 meters. I'm down. Oh, fucking what? Oh. What's in here? Anything good? Ah. Apparently the answer to that question is yes. Can I literally mine ion cubes? That's cool. I guess there's a way to get the uh, prawn suit up over here. Huh. Well, now we're above it all. That's great.
Totally useless. All right, I'm going to go back this way. Ow. Um, because I want to see if we can't get to this artifact beacon. I assume that it's on this island, but I really have no idea. Free water, thank you. What? Why did that hurt me? Yeah, don't say. I can't seek shelter if there's no shelter to seek. Give me another thermal vent or something. I can warm up in. What the fuck? Excuse me? Okay. Apparently you don't give a fuck. Come on. Thermal vent? Something? Anything? There's a cave. Maybe this cave will warm me up. Yes, it will. Oh, there you go. 33 meters away. Okay, where the freaking frack is it? Obviously not this way, because this isn't going down, but... Ooh, maybe it's this way. Somehow I doubt it. Well, this is new. I was, like, walking across the bridge, and I saw these little lights over here, and I was like, I bet you that might be something. Ooh, it's really dark in here. Uh, considering there's just an ion... Well, that's pretty unambiguous that this is where I was supposed to be going. Is there anything else down here that I can scan that's cool? Ooh, another iron cube. Is that it? What's this? Uh, I don't really care about that. Where's the... the... Oh, research. Alien data? Energy generator. Um, yep. Charged ion cube stored within these supercapacitors used to smooth power transients. Sure. What is this? Equipment? Oh, yeah, the thumper. High impact sonic pulses, uh, disturbing underground attackers. Yeah, that's how I like distract the worm. I have a feeling that that thumper is going to come in handy later. Like, very much come in handy later. Okay, well, um, we, we came, we saw, and uh, that's all she wrote. How the fuck do I get out of here? Where's the exit? Oh, it is that way. Uh, yeah, we came, we saw, we conquered. Uh, but, pretty sure that we are out of time. It's kind of hard to tell for me, but. Anyways, I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, please drop a like and a subscribe. Uh, come back. Two weeks, um, usually, every, well, not usually, it will happen. Every other week I post a new episode of Subnautica um, every other Monday. So, sorry, every other Friday. Um, so, if you guys are enjoying this series, then come back next week and hang out with me again. I look forward to seeing you uh, then. So, I guess, coming up, um, we're going to have, we got to do a couple of things on the house for sure. Because we have the ability to make a moon pool now. Um, so that we can do some of the other upgrades on, like, the the sea truck and the uh, the prawn suit. We also got to rename the prawn suit. Um, I'm thinking Shrimp 2.0. 2. Because uh, Shrimp was the name of our prawn suit from Season 1 of Subnautica. So, if you guys have a better idea, then please let me know. Um, if not, then that's what we're going with. And you can deal with it. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, not a heck of a lot left to really talk about. I'm going to repair this and head back to the house and dump a whole bunch of stuff that we have that we picked up, which will be nice. And, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys in two weeks. Midnight Sun out.